So hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and I am back today with the new microservices deployment. So here are the few brief points I have noted down. So this is going to be a 10 plus microservice deployment onto EKS cluster, right? And the EKS cluster today which we are going to create a CTL command. So and today we will see a multi-branch pipeline concept of Jenkins. And today we will see post based event trigger. So whenever some changes we are going to do onto the GitHub, automatically the build pipeline will get triggered. We will see individual microservices commit. That basically, uh, a single microservice level changes, code changes that you are going to do, that is not going to impact other services. So this is the beauty of this project. So we are going to deploy this complete project onto AWS Cloud and uh, we are going to use tools like AWS CLI. So let me give you a quick walkthrough of the uh, project. So this is going to be the e-commerce project repository. That is a GitHub repository. I will give you a quick walkthrough of that as well. And here are the uh, 11 plus services we do have that we are going to deploy today. The complete uh, microservices. Now let me give you a quick walkthrough of the GitHub repository that we are going to use today. So this is what uh, my GitHub repository name is, Ultimate Microservices. So you can come here and you can see here are 13 branches. Okay, but what I have said, like there are going to be 11 microservices. So, two uh, two microservices are these are not microservices. The first main, if you will see, it is containing a Jenkins file. So, if you will see the Jenkins file which we have here, this is deploying. This is deploying to the Kubernetes cluster, and this is going to verify the deployment. And if you will see the deployment or service, this is containing everything related to the services deployment like so before getting into that let's just understand first our repository structure and another you will see this is the infrastructure setup like in order to deploy this particular e-commerce project we have to build the infrastructure so if you will go to the infrastructure setup here we have everything what step we need to do apart from that uh, you can see all other uh, microservices so the ad service every microservices will have a docker file having this check this file as well it is building the docker file and it is pushing the docker image to the docker hub so you can see uh, it is pushing to my particular docker hub account and which service ad service so similarly every service will have the same file 